lost horizon. The spaceship through the vast darkness of space, the crew inside tense and worried as alarms blare and lights flash. Suddenly, the ship shudders violently and sparks fly, sending it off course into a strange, uncharted planet. Captain, brace for impact. The spaceship crash lands on the alien planet, the crew shaken but alive. They step out cautiously, taking in the unfamiliar landscape around them, filled with strange plants and animals. As they explore, they come across a group of alien creatures, humanoid in shape but with glowing eyes and strange markings on their skin. The crew tries to communicate with them, but the aliens seem hostile and aggressive. Camilla, we come in peace, we're stranded here, can you help us? The aliens growl in advance, prompting the crew to run for cover. They stumble upon a hidden cave and decide to seek refuge there, hoping to find a way to repair their ship and escape. Days pass as the crew struggles to survive in the hostile environment, with dwindling supplies and no way to contact the outside world. Strange occurrences start happening, with gravity seeming to fluctuate and distort reality. As tensions rise within the crew they begin to turn on each other, paranoia and fear consuming them. It becomes clear that something sinister is at play on this mysterious planet, something beyond their understanding. In a shocking twist it is revealed that the planet itself is alive, a sentient being manipulating gravity and perception to toy with the crew. The crew must band together to outsmart the planet, and find a way back home before it's too late. As the crew prepares for a final showdown with the planet, the ground beneath them begins to shake and crack, revealing a portal back to their ship. With a renewed sense of hope and determination, they make a break for it, the planet's dark lofter echoing behind them. In a heart-pounding climax, the crew manages to escape through the portal just as the planet collapses in on itself, disappearing into the void. They breathe a sigh of relief. Grateful to be alive and back in the safety of their ship,